Yes. Can I ask you? Yeah. Are you a true Maasai? Yeah, I'm from Maasai. I'm true Maasai, 100%. <laughs> oh, that's yeah. good. Yeah. So, guys, it's my first time meeting a real lifetime Maasai person. I've always watched you guys on the camera. Yeah, welcome. Yeah. yeah. Please introduce yourself. Hello, family. Welcome to Shami, Shami Vlogs TV. Uh, Shami's Vlogs. My name is Sleepy. And my channel name is Masai with a passport. Masai with a passport. Oh, you're yeah. different. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I, I really love your beads. Wow, thank you. And yeah, welcome. Let's check out the, the elephant. So, can I visit Masai? Yeah. Am I free to visit you in yeah. your home? Yeah. yeah. When I'm home, you're free to come. So, where's your place? Masai Mara. The home of the big five and the ugly five. Guys, wait. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I, I guess you're the richest person here now. Because they told me people who come from the Masai Mara are the richest. <laughs> In terms of the wild, the wild everything. The <laughs> yeah, because it's really beautiful. Yeah, yeah, very true. It's very beautiful. Um, our richness is from the cows. Oh my yeah. god, I really have a dream of visiting Ma the Masai Mara. Yes. I always watch a lot of videos on yeah, that. So, yeah. which advice can you give someone like me, yeah. a small YouTuber who want to visit Masai Mara? Because they said it's expensive. Yeah, it's very expensive, but through me, I'll take you maybe to some places. Maybe if you want to see uh, not all the big five, but a few of them. And mm. also experience the life of uh, Masai in Manyata. Okay. Manyata is uh, some houses built of a cow dung, soil, and sticks. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So I followed you on Instagram. Please yeah. follow me back on Shami Vlog thank and you, we can connect from there. Wow, thank you so yeah. much. You're welcome. Karibu, guys, akuna matata. Akuna matata, guys. Yeah. Check that outfit. Yeah. It's it's a real lifetime. That's how I person. Oh yeah. my god. Yeah. I've always dreamt of coming that side and I love the beads, everything. It blends. You're welcome. And I wanted to ask you, in your vlogs, I see you walking. Yeah. Do you really walk or you reach somewhere and take some, uh, really, some bike? I really walk, uh, but uh, through this function, mm. I, have not, I have not walked. But uh, three months ago, I walked to all East African countries, including uh, Kenya, Tanzania, Uganda. You walk using your legs? Yes. Oh my God. Yeah. And that's why I win this medal. Oh. From some of the converse, uh, con conservancies so this is a medal this is a medal is because a medal. you walked yeah i walked more than 1000 kilometers across east africa eh. walked to save the elephant and the orphans yeah eh. and I have, I, i'm really and I have surprised and also uh, that on that walk i used to walk to build a library in my community oh. that uh, was a charity walk oh. Uh, to build a library in my community because mm. children from my village they walk 10 to 15 kilometers the age of 4 to 10 mm. uh, in dangers of wild animals so yeah that the big five the elephant lion as uh, buffaloes rhino and leopards okay okay yeah that was a great walk yeah. actually some of us we just enjoyed the walk videos we didn't know that it was a charity uh, it was a charity I think because i didn't watch from start yeah th th thank you so much for having a kind heart thank you thank you oh my god yeah. guys follow his youtube channel i'll leave it in the description box he walks miles yeah. he walks miles for charity Actually, please go support uh, where him are you from? i'm a ugandan i'm ugandan so i've been to different places in uganda the villages mm. and also to to kampala please come yeah. uh, i am in kampala I've been there so if you so, come uh, there, uh, please. Nakalama, Gakiri, yeah. all those places, interior part of Uganda, I've been there because I used to sleep in the villages. Mm. Uh, sometimes I got lost. Sometimes I sure. uh, got new people who support me, give me somewhere to put my tent. Sure. And uh, surviving with the fruit in Uganda. Sleeping at River Nile. Actually, oh. Uganda is so beautiful. Uh, Uganda is very beautiful. We are blessed very, with very nature, beautiful. actually. Yeah, so let me ask you: yeah. When you're walking, yeah. you encounter harsh animals like lions. In Uganda? 
in Uganda, I don't think because don't they're in specific because, places. Uh, yeah, yeah. This side because in Kenya. When I cross and I cross the biggest forest in Uganda. That's Mabira. Mabira Forest. Yeah. Mabira, and I was going live every time I walk, going live, and also creating videos, shots, because I used to have my power bank and uh, mm. solar on my bag. Mm. So moving, streaming. Oh, yeah. that's so beautiful. Yes. So guys, but in my let owners, me yeah. count a lot of animals, the wild and uh, the, yeah. So if you find a lion, mm -hmm. you're walking, yeah. how do you defend yourself? You know, sometimes when you walk, you walk, you get tired. Mm. You feel like even if the lion come, just eat you, okay? But uh, the lion just look at you also, it's like a person, yeah? You can just speak to the animals, like the way that we speak to now. Because you can take your dog and you train. Mm. You can really speak when you see, tell the dog stop to stop. But you, if you don't fear anything, when you are tired, you can just, I'm tired. This is the end. Now I can't do anything. You see? That's the right time that you see the, uh, the lion must be maybe going. Or maybe the elephant just going up. Have you ever encountered one? Not ever. I've been crossing the park and showing people this is the elephant, this is the lion. On far from there, just some few meters. When I'm walking. Has what if, if it wants to, to attack you, you how do yeah. you defend yourself i want to see that moment it's ready to attack you yeah i have never been attacked by the any animals the wild ah. animals but once when i was 11 years ago mm. uh, looking at the animals in the jungle mm. i was hit by the baby elephant mm. yeah that only that time oh but, uh, do you smear some herbs to protect you because like and, and how, no, how? no story about the abs it's all about loving the animals and loving the nature oh. yeah and also you know uh, the wild animals they know re they really know the bad man and a better man good man the man who have a good at they really know that if you're a poacher they mm. just smell and see this guy is not a good oh, person yeah. so they communicate yeah. yeah they communicate like now you can communicate with the nature the yeah, trees so. So guys, yeah. let me know if you knew that you can communicate with nature, with animals mm -hmm. and everything. And still, we are at the Villa Madjin, yeah. Yeah, in Nyamohanse village. A very beautiful place that I found this that's, wall that's actually. That's why when you have a lot of trees, yeah. maybe you have a lot of trees, you go to the river, yeah. you listen to the sound, to of, the sound the, of the, the water. water. And I love that. You become so, like, you forget everything that you are thinking. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, and also in the jungle, you can just go you know the most uh, the most uh, on this walk i've done it make you connected to god mostly mm. because every time you walk you pray in god god help me reach this place yeah, exactly. god help me reach this place so it has a lot of benefits when you walk mm. it's only not about just walking mm. it make you come closer to come god. closer to god yeah because sometimes you can find maybe some accident on the road Sometimes you find maybe it's a dangerous place you got lost in the jungle. Mm. You only pray to God, yeah. Guys, yeah. I actually I'm someone who has a lot of fear. Yeah. Even when I'm walking alone and something just does I'll shout. Yeah. But, so uh, what do you, what advice do you give to some people who walk at night when they hear any sound or something like that? Actually there's one weapon that maybe if you want to walk at night, only one weapon all animals the wild animals they really really fear and this is the torch or the light if you have light at night you no know, any animal will come closer to you they really fear the light yeah all right thank uh, you so much i didn't know that guys <laughs> we have to get lights actually <laughs> yes when yeah. you're moving at night even if you have maybe a car mm. and the animals are passing there just like just the flash, flash it they just go Actually, Africa is proud of having you. Yeah, thank you. So I much. watch your video myself. I'm your fan. Yeah, welcome. Yeah, thank yeah. you. So, thank you so much. Subscribe to Shami Vlogs. Yeah. Uh, and also, you can check me out. Yeah. Masai with a passport. Masai you know, the with a I'm passport. I'm saying that the Masai with a passport, it's because uh, most of the Masai, they just walk from. Uh, Kenya to Tanzania, Uganda without a passport, mm. uh, looking at the wild, uh, looking at the animals uh, for the green pasture. But for me, 
I'm so lucky because I have a passport. Yeah. That's so good. Yeah. Actually, maybe you're the only person who has a passport who is a Maasai. Yeah, we have some of them, but, but uh, not like many. the travelers, I think I'm, I'm, yeah. uh, I'm lucky. Thank you so much yes. for giving us the Maasai they, well, they don't show us on TV. Yeah, now I'm going to show you more and more in the villages and uh, not only in my homeland, but in different places. I would like to be on that journey as well. Yeah, welcome. Yeah. So is it expensive? Like if I want to come and do videos there for like a week? Yeah, if you want to get into the park, it's very expensive. Mm. If you want to interact with the villagers, very simple life like where you are right now. Mm. Very simple life. If mm. I come to like I was in Uganda, mm. if you enjoy the village life, the same. Right, yeah. Thank you. So not like it's very expensive. Expensive like the hotels. Mm. Like uh, hiring uh, a tent. The, the safaris. Oh. To take you to see the big five and the ugly five. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So thank you so much. Yeah, I really appreciate the Maasai with a passport. It was yeah. nice thank talking you. to you. Thank you. So and you're kind and humble. Thank you. God bless uh, you. Amen. Yeah. This is uh, my church on YouTube channel, the chef. I'm here. telling you. Yeah. We are preparing. By the way, how is the meal? Good. Yeah. Have you eaten? Yes. yes. Yeah. No. We, we, right have we have it. Yeah. Yeah. But, yeah. but we yeah. yesterday. We tested on Friday. On Friday yeah, because yeah. the whole weekend we weren't here. Yeah, yeah. It's very nice, guys. We do, we do, we do our best. Not our best, but we are the best. <laughs> we are the best. <laughs> yeah, we have the again. best. Can you give us an opportunity to cook for you as well? Yeah. One of these days. Okay, okay. we'll. We'll see, we'll talk with the head cook Not and, me, yeah. and organize. And so, we cook guys, for you meat, you love it. Meat? Everything By the you way, want. Hey, I, I would love to eat matoke. Do you know how to prepare matoke? Very matoke? well, so give us matoke. We telling you we should prepare for our matoke. Uganda anyway. I'll, I will talk with the chief chef. So, so. Ah, matoke, matoke. <laughs> okay guys, my name is uh, Machacha. So, I'm uh, Machacha on YouTube channel. Let me show you. Can, Okay. So guys, right now we are in Ayamara's kitchen at the Villa so, Medjin. Yeah, this is right. Show us. So maybe you can come and show them. So here we are preparing rice. Rice. Very hot. I can't push it, but it's rice. Yeah. Inside here. So yes, that's here. rice. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Yeah. Oh, that's rice. Yeah. 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 The scent is yeah. killing. Yeah. Nice. I am that's my rice. church. So guys, in here. We have some cabbage. Yes. Yeah. The cabbage. You can just come. Come in and show them. <laughs> yeah. This is the cabbage here. Yeah. Yeah. So, okay. So, guys, and here we have the other, the skumawiki and the meat. There, the meat there. So, yeah. So we are done with the cooking mm. and uh, now we are just preparing to serve. To serve? Yeah. Okay, Mahacha, how long have you stayed here at the villa? At the villa? Yes. I've stayed here for uh, around four weeks. That is one month. One month? Yeah. Wow. wow. Yeah. That's a big time, eh? A long time. Yeah, yeah, four weeks, one month. So I've been, I've chef. been here once. Are you a professional chef? Or? Yeah. Oh, no, I'm not. Actually, I'm an HR by profession. Mm. But you know, I love cooking from young age. My mother, I came from a single parent. Mm. Not not just single, my father passed out when I was young and not started school. So my mother used to put us to do these things. So I grew up cooking. Okay. That's why I love cooking. But I'm not uh, I'm an HR by profession, human resource management. Okay. By profession. <laughs> so this okay, it is nice. life. Yeah. Now I'm a YouTuber. Yeah. My profession difference is a matter of making money. I say it, it I, I always say it is not not what you love but what works. Yeah exactly. What what works. That's yeah. what matters. Yeah. yeah. All so right. I that. think we can go out. Thank so you. thank you, thank you, ladies. Thank you, Welcome. So guys, that is the kitchen. We didn't really get the full details because of some unavoidable circumstances. But this is the tank by using. The, I don't know. I am a chacha. Why are you getting this water from? First, come, please. Yeah. Come. So, guys, we have a water tank here. I just want I am Machacha tell us why they're getting this water. 
So why are you getting this water from the one you're using to cook? This one from the river. Which we river? We pump it from the river. This river. That's the. That's the very water used to cook. Yeah, we pump it, then we treat. It's treated. Then yeah. Oh, you pump it and treat it. Yeah. So rain because when you check in the river, it's not pure white. No, but you know, the, the river you know is flowing, so it doesn't have. You know, in up country, most people we use even in the my village, we use the the water from the river. Even we don't treat, but in our village, you don't treat it. For real. But nothing. Like so, clean. how which type you know, of flowing water? Yeah. Flowing water is no problem. The river flows. Yeah. So, which type of chemicals do you use to treat it? I don't. Know, I, I don't want to say water. I don't. Know, I've never asked. But you always put chemicals inside. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. I thought it's from the river and direct cooking. No, no, no. no, no. It's <laughs> All right. yeah. Thank you so much for that clarification. And guys, this is where the washing plates from. Let me show you. This is where the washing plates from and Kobenata. Yes. She's guys. already doing her job. Yeah. Guys, this is Kobenata over here. Thank you, Shami Vlogs UG, for welcoming to your channel. Hey, unique name in the YouTube. YouTube. Guys, please subscribe. I'm now working on the watch hour. So please, guys, watch the video up to the end. You see? Like so that exactly. I can get those watch hours. Eh? And subscribe also. We need the subscription. We need that one actually. Yeah. It's free of charge. At least I rose to 5k. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, guys, please watch and subscribe. Guys, guess what? She was here cleaning utensils. Yeah. You know, we are in the kitchen department and we are right here. That's why they've even given us permission to film there. Hi, Mama. Are you good? Are you a content creator? Not really. So, please, what's your name? Mary? Yes. Okay, nice meeting you, Mary. Me too. <laughs> All right. So, guys, that beautiful lady, she's not a content creator, but she's right there helping. <laughs> so, guys, let me show you where they get the water from. How are you? Are you good? They get water from that river. That river. That's where they get water from. And they treat it. Oh my god. I would love to see them treating it. Though I haven't seen. But I would love to. Yeah. Hi. This is Kobenara. How are you? Yeah. You're a YouTuber? No. Oh, you should create a YouTube channel. It's fine. Yeah. It's not now. Okay. Why? Because we don't have the phone. Oh, oh so you don't have the phone? Yeah. yeah. Wow. You'll get it. You'll get it, inshallah. Yeah. So, guys, thank you, Abby. Thank you. So, guys, we also have a hot grill here. We're going to be grilling goat's meat, beef, steak, everything, chicken, yeah. Still in the kitchen of Ayamara's villa. Hello. Hello. How are you? Oh, you're shooting? Yeah, uh, you can. I wanted to talk to you off camera. You